All right, friends, new arrival number two this week. We needed more fall into winter dresses. There's so many special occasions that you celebrate in the fall, whether it's family photos, engagement photos, anniversary dinners, weddings or showers that you're going to, all kinds of fun things. Even despite kind of a weird world, we want to have your special occasion pieces here. So here we go with the Sheridan tie dress. She is just what this shop needed. You can tell already that she is a black and beige kind of taupey pattern. What I love about that, I love a classic black and white pattern, but this kind of beige gives it the best fall vibe, I think, with these muted colors. So it's 100% rayon. That means it's 100% no stretch, but I think you're going to find out that no stretch is no problem with the Sheridan tie dress because this cut could not be any more forgiving and I'm going to keep it a secret. I'm going to wait to have it fixed how it should be now, but at the end I will show you just how much room you're going to have to work in this thing. So I am, you can kind of, you can tell how lightweight and flowy she is, but I am not wearing a slip and I don't think there's any reason to wear a slip. Just a heads up. If you want to because you're just more comfortable, then you go ahead and do that. We have those available on the shop, but I don't think in terms of like see-throughness that you need one for the Sheridan. So let's start at the very top and talk about this neckline. She's a modest V neckline, easy to get on over your head um, and move around. And it's not too wide that my bra straps are showing, um, just as a little point of reference there. Standard shoulder seam, probably. This is how a typical, I don't have very broad shoulders. This is how a typical small would fit on me with the shoulder seam right there. And then it goes into these fun bishop sleeves. So, Loose, relaxed sleeves with elastic around the cuff. So it makes it super duper comfortable. Not too cut, like you can see how it can slide over my hand. Not too tight to be uncomfortable, but tight enough to make this dress really practical. Your sleeves aren't getting in your way, all of that jazz. So going down the dress, you get to these two little loops on one on each side that hold your functioning tie. Can you see this tie? I know black is hard to show all of the details, but this tie is functioning. You can place it, not only can you place it like to the side or to the front or to the other side or even to the back, but you can place it however you want it to give you the silhouette that you, that is most flattering for your body. So um, whether you place it a little bit higher, I have it pulled up a little bit higher to cinch right at my natural waistline, or you take it down a little bit lower, totally up to you. A plus to this style is that this is totally maternity friendly. You could even wear this for a maternity photo shoot this fall. Gorgeous, because you can place this above your bump and you're going to have plenty of room in this dress for a baby bump if you've got one going on. Otherwise, it's a dress that's really comfortable that you're going to be able to create the most flattering silhouette in. So going down the dress, do you see the little, I'll give you a close-up, it has this little ruffle detail before it goes to this kind of like last tier layer here at the bottom. And this ruffle and this tier are a high-low hemline. Look at how gorgeous that is. I'm like thinking of a reason I could wear this right now. Maybe I'll wear this in our fall family photos. So classy, kind of has a little bit, it's like of a slightly boho-ish vibe. It's, it's got all kinds of looks going on, in my opinion. This little uh, hemline is kind of like a timeless look, but yeah, all of the things. Okay, I this is available in small, medium, and large. I am wearing a size small. You will see Meredith and Becca in a size medium. Meredith fell in love, took one home with her. Can't wait to see it on her. Y'all, at a 34C, I have more than enough, I mean, look, room in this chest. Again, I told you, no stretch, 
no problem in the Sheridan. I got myself all messed up. I'm a 326 around my waist. I have plenty of room and look at, I mean, if please, this dress, it's like a girl's fit, like dreaminess, whatever. The most dreamy fit you could possibly imagine. And I am 5'5". Five, five. The front of it is coming midi length on me, a couple of few inches below my knee. And then in the back, it's coming right to the top of my ABBA clogs. So what I wanted to show you about this really quick, this is the last thing I'm gonna show you, is if I untie this dress, it's like just a little, I mean, you could, you could also wear it like this, but just to give you an idea of how much fabric and room you have to work with, you don't have to worry about the fact that this doesn't have stretch. There is so much room in this size small on me. There is so much room around the chest, around the waist, around the hips for just a really flowy, fun dress. So make sizing really, really easy. We will give you sizing suggestions on the website on Thursday um, after we see all of the try-ons with all of the different body shapes this week. But just so you know, I would stick true to size for sure. And I love that even with a dress that's really oversized right when you put it on, when you cinch it up with this little girl, perfect, flattering, feminine fit. I love both looks, actually. <laughs> I had never undone the tie and like just played with it, but that is fun. Y'all, the Sheridan, she's cute.